Hi, this is Dave from Gyra. Welcome to today's Thought for the Week, which is called Back to the Wilderness. We're continuing to follow the What's in the Bible for Me series written by Lucy Moore. It's going through the Bible in 50 sessions. You can buy the book by contacting me from your local Christian bookshop or online. It costs about £5. We've been looking about how Jesus taught and healed as he walked amongst everyday people on the street. Today, we're thinking about Jesus displaying social responsibility. The reading is taken from Matthew 14, and I'll be reading from the contemporary English version. That evening, the disciples came to Jesus and said, This place is like a desert, and it's already late. Let the crowds leave so they can go to the villages and buy some food. Jesus replied, They don't have to leave. Why don't you give them something to eat? But they said, We have only five small loaves of bread and two fish. Jesus asked his disciples to bring the food to him, and he told the crowd to sit down on the grass. Jesus took the five loaves and the two fish. He looked up towards heaven and blessed the food. Then he broke the bread and handed it to his disciples, and they gave it to the people. Long ago, God's faithfulness to people was shown by God providing bread and meat for them in the desert. Here, Jesus shows who he is and that he stands in the tradition of Moses by doing something very similar. The disciples are all for packing the people off, hungry as they are, so they can fend for themselves. Jesus wants them to understand something both about their own responsibilities as his followers and about his compassion and power that longs for people to stay close to him where their needs can be met. They do not need to go away. You give them something to eat. The people of God are on a journey again, a journey of relearning how much God cares for them and wants to provide for them, blessing them through everyday gifts of staple food. If people were fed years ago by God's own hand, and Jesus is here feeding people by his own hand, what does that hint about who Jesus is? And a couple of things to think about. What does it say about the responsibilities of those who follow Jesus? How can we feed or meet the needs of people around us? Thanks for listening.